Hey, for us, uh, do you know uh, what you're going to dress up for as Halloween just yet? Trick or treat. You know what? These pets know right here. Uh, showing off their coolest costumes. <laughs> this is the shot we've been waiting for. He looks happy, doesn't he? Aww. This is Roscoe Village Animal Hospital hosting its sixth annual Halloween bash uh, today. And plenty of those four-legged friends are mm, available right for here. adoption. Maybe they'll even throw in the costume as well. Oh. Uh, also, there's a professional pet photographer there. <laughs> Silent auction, a games for kids, monster. yes, addition to all the costume contests. I was wondering that they like wearing these yeah, things. Yeah, they do. My little guy's going as a Chicago bull. He's got the Benny the Bull outfit. Oh, really? He also has a Bears outfit, too, and a White Sox. <laughs> Why are we going to get a Black Hawk? Yeah, yeah there come you on. Go. It's his name. We shouldn't be surprised. Petey. 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 Rothby Petey Drain Road. What about your pugs? <laughs> uh, if my wife chooses to, but I don't think so. Oh. <laughs> We'll talk right. more about dogs later. All right, that's our news for this evening. Thanks for being with us. I'm Karen Jordan. I'm Robbie Bagewell. For Phil Schwartz, Rafer Weigel, Jim Rose, the entire ABC7 News team, thanks for watching. And come on back again tonight, 10 o'clock.